On this date in twisted history, on June the 29th, 1914, Gina Guseva attempted to assassinate the most evil man in Russia. That's right, she stabbed and tried to kill Grigory Rasputin in his hometown of Pokroskov, Siberia. Rasputin was visiting his wife in Homokula, excuse me, his children, and decided to walk off his dinner. Gina Gusava rushed up to him and stabbed him in the gut with a knife and screamed, I have killed the Antichrist. Rasputin was able to fight her off and run away, but she gave pursuit, stabbing at him with her knife. The townsfolk were able to pull Gusava away from Rasputin and protect him. Thwarted, Gusava turned herself into the authorities. Rasputin survived his gut wound and returned to the capital. The peasant woman Gina Gusava was eventually tried for the attempted murder of Rasputin, but was found not guilty on reason of being insane and placed in an asylum. She was released in 1917, about a year after Rasputin was finally banished back to hell. One interesting note about Gusava, she didn't have a nose. It was missing the entire time. She also claimed that she never had syphilis and never explained how her nose went missing. It was 1914, and it was well known in Russia that Baba Yaga demanded weird payments for the help in killing demons, devils, and the assorted Antichrist. If you need help dealing with demons, devils, and antichrists, try hitting like, subscribe, and share. If nothing else, it will at least drive away the evil spirits of boredom and ennui.